can't go to the bathroom? Well, you've come to the right place. Give me that acid. So I'm gonna show you guys how it is that I make my you know what smoothie. My boyfriend's actually the one that called it that because anytime he can't go to the bathroom, I give him one of these and he just goes immediately. I just, I love it, I have it every morning and it tastes delicious, so why not give it a try? And if you're having trouble going to the bathroom, well, you know, you already know what you gotta, what you gotta do and what you gotta make. So what you'll need is a blender and to this what you're gonna add is some bananas and yes they do have to be frozen because we want this to be a nice cold smoothie. I do about one full banana and with this you get your good carbs in for the morning and then you're gonna add in some frozen spinach. Now spinach is one of the foods highest in magnesium. It has an overall calming effect on your body so it can help with sleep, anxiety and your digestion. Digestion, so you already know what that means. You're also gonna add in some hemp seeds. Now hemp seeds are literally nature's superfood. They're high in good omega-3s, so they have some good healthy fats in there which help reduce inflammation. They're high in fiber, high in protein. I mean, what else can you ask for? I do about two to three tablespoons of this. Then you wanna add in some cocoa powder. Yes, I'm fancy with my Ghirardelli 100% cocoa powder. Now, now, cocoa powder is very high in fiber and in antioxidants so this is also going to help aid with that digestion process i do about one tablespoon of this next you're going to want to add in your cinnamon and i put this in everything it has great antimicrobial and anti-inflammatory benefits it balances your insulin levels which helps stabilize your blood sugar so this simple ingredient can help so much with weight loss then you're going to want to add in some pumpkin seeds Seeds. These provide really good healthy fats and pumpkin seeds are one of the number one foods that help kill off parasites. Parasites that you may not even know you have. I kind of just sprinkle this in, but I would say I add about a good two tablespoons of pumpkin seeds. Now, of course, you cannot forget to add in your honey. This is nature's natural sweetener. I like to add in about one to two tablespoons and it's gonna make your smoothie taste amazing. Now, for the milk, I like to do a little bit of banana milk. This is one of the cleanest milks that I've found at my local grocery store the ingredients seem to be very clean they're not filled with all these weird chemical ingredients and I love to add in some whole milk this is one of the cleanest things you can buy it has all of the essential nutrients that you need it has your fats your proteins your carbohydrates now I only do a splash of this just because it is higher in calories and now we're gonna blend everything up once I've blended it for about a minute or so, now what you're gonna do is add in some ice because we want this to be real nice, creamy, and cold. So I do about a handful of ice and back to blending it again. And now grab yourself a fancy cup and serve up your delicious smoothie and enjoy. All right, so I'm gonna finish this up and I'll see you guys in the next one. I've got a smoothie for you that's gonna get you all cleared up from everything that's all backed up. Door needs to stay open.